Now, here's your pinpoint weather forecast with meteorologist Henry Grant. We're almost towards the end of the week and we're really feeling the heat this time around. This morning we were in the 50s, but temperatures continuing to climb thanks to that sunshine and relatively calm winds. So looking absolutely beautiful, albeit just a bit hot for this time of year. Marietta looking beautiful with those blue skies right now, saying around 79 degrees. Humidity, dew points in the upper 50s, making it feel like the low 80s. So it's going to be feeling a little bit sticky out there, but this is something we typically deal with in the middle of summer, not this early. So it's going to be taking a little bit to get used to, but still quite nice. Definitely time to spend outside as we stay dry across the region. Really high pressure still protecting us. And it's also the reason why it's bringing in that warm, humid air today. But then we're tracking the system. It's going to be bringing in that chance of rain. But over the next 24 hours, really nothing to worry about. So try to get outside. Enjoy this warm weather while you can. All of us in the upper 70s for now. Some spots now into the 80s like Harrisville, Ravenswood, and Athens. But we should all be able to hop on and get into those upper 80s this afternoon. Now, 88 is our forecasted high for Parkersburg, 89 into Marietta. We're going to see if we can get that daily high record tied or potentially beaten, but that chance is going to be very low. The focus will be on the MOV airport where the data is collected. And right now, daily record high is set at 90. So as we continue to push through the rest of the day, Clear skies around, plenty of sunshine with a few clouds here or there, but that'll start to increase overnight tonight as that low draws closer to the region. We're not going to be seeing any rain for Friday morning, so we'll still stay dry with mostly cloudy skies, but into the afternoon, we'll see that chance for a few stray showers, isolated thunderstorm possible. Low threat for now, it starts to increase even more once we get into Friday night. So if you're thinking about trying to get any gardening done over the next few days, today, probably the best idea or Friday morning. But once we hit Saturday and Sunday, that's when we'll see our best chance of rain moving in. And don't forget, if you're spending some time outside, bring the sunblock, the sunscreen if you can. So let's focus on that rain. That's going to be moving in. Friday night becoming more widespread moving into Saturday morning before we start to kick that out and really just focus on scattered showers and thunderstorms for Saturday afternoon. But afterwards, we're going to be in this bit of a looping pattern of showers and storms scattered around during our afternoon time frame. So that'll be the case Sunday and Monday still again, Tuesday, Wednesday. Temperatures this time going to be a bit steady. We'll be looking at upper 70s to low 80s, still above average for this time of year. So if you're looking forward to summer, I'll just say this now. Summer, in my opinion, has started. How likely do you think we're going to be reaching that 90? It's, it's a low chance. Oh, okay. It's a low chance. Darn. So <laughs> Everything is pretty much steady. We're not going to okay. have any cloud cover interfering with anything. But it's so a possibility. It's a chance. There's still a possibility. <laughs> it's a chance. <laughs> How would you feel if we reached 90 degrees, Henry? I would be honest. <laughs> would you be upset? I, I would be surprised. Really? Yeah, would I don't you go outside I don't want... and enjoy it? It's too early for the 90s. <laughs> you won't go outside and enjoy it? No, too early. Okay. Okay. We'll see about it. <laughs> we'll, I'll ask you tomorrow. 